Well, I'm uh, on my work today. Um, it's one of those days where I'm feeling so ambitious that going to work seems like um, slacking off. Um, problem is with work is um, it's kind of required to pay the bills. And um, the other problem is is that it just uses up so much time. It's like, uh, as an artist, you it's like you have to spend all your time working to pay the bills, but, you know, hey folks, if you're an artist, you understand this, um, art takes a lot of fucking time. I mean, it's not like we can whip this shit out on, you know, in, in five minutes. You know, some of this stuff can take weeks. So, it's, um, I, I've actually applied for a position in the same company where I actually can do my work from home, which is going to be nice. Um, my normal commute takes me about an hour to get to work and about an hour to get back. So that'll save me two hours out of the day. So looking forward to that. Um, so this weekend was really good. Oh, here comes the train. Um, and another train. So, uh, this gig at Lazy Bones, and another train. Uh, which is going to change my topic just a little bit. Um, I was thinking about doing a, a, a video podcast every single day. You know, do a video blog every single day. Well, this whole thing about the uh, Facebook banning of, of body painters... And the fact that my wife is doing a, um, a report on that for her, uh, her master's, which is heading into her PhD, uh, she needs the computer, which means that I have to do everything on my phone. So um, this is going to be a little bit difficult. Um, everything has to be done, all the editing and all that stuff has to be done on my phone. Fortunately, technology is kind of caught up with us, but uh, it makes me realize that we really need to get a... Uh... So basically, I need more space. This isn't going to work. I think I freed up enough space this time. So, um, pretty much, um, I'm going to try and keep this going. Oh. Now I've arrived. I think the biggest challenge is going to find a place that's quiet. A lot of buses today. So, um, yeah, this whole phone thing, I need to get another computer. So... As I was saying, um, the, uh, the the painting this weekend went really, really well. Um, we um, the the owner of the club, Lazy Bones, was really happy with the results. Uh, the band was just awesome. Uh, the band was called the Subterraneans. Uh, definitely, if you have a chance and you're in Sydney and you get a chance to go to Lazy Bones and see them, yeah, see them. It's pretty good stuff. Um, let's see. So, uh, one of the fun parts was is that um, I started painting about 7 o'clock. These paintings take a while to do. So, I'm painting on stage, and the band sets up in front of me, which is, you know, pretty normal. Well, what ends up happening is, is that um, when they set up and they start to play, um, you know, I'm, I'm stuck back there. I, I, can't, I can't do anything. So... Um, I'm trying to hide, and, um, no, not, not really hide, because everybody, everybody knows I'm there, but I'm not the focus, you know, you got the band, and then you got the model, and the model's glowing in the dark, which is, uh, if, if you ever a chance, a blacklight body painting is awesome, especially in live venues like this, and, uh, I realize I'm stuck back here, I can't move, so, um, this next clip is gonna be from my point of view, from the band. Now, also understand that at this time that I'm taking the video, I'm in a very cramped spot because I'm leaning back on a speaker and uh, yeah, that's pretty wild. <laughs> 